what is happening buddy welcome back to the channel thank you so much for joining me and sky on another video decided to give you guys a quick little life update what is happening here in my life quick little update to the channel what to expect because i'm getting a lot of comments messages uh dms on instagram facebook messages facebook comments about where I am, where my videos are, people are concerned about my safety <laughs> and all that stuff. So I just wanted, uh, because, you know, like I did like a really like depressing video a couple weeks ago and then kind of stopped putting out content. So people are like, are you okay? Are you alive? What is happening? What is going on? So I just want to come on real quick, do a quick video. Not gonna, hopefully it won't be too long, we'll see. Give you guys a little life update and what is going to uh, come to this channel so if you guys are here for a garage sale video of like picking and stuff this will not be the video you guys can skip this one if you don't care about that um we'll be bringing garage sale videos in, in the future so first um update to that video first of all thank you guys to majority of you 99.9 percent .9 of you guys were really amazing really incredible left me really really nice comments um the ones that i did read thank you so much uh, for that I was encouraged by a couple of my friends to delete the YouTube Studio app, uh, which is the app that um, is on your phone that tells you how your video is performing and it's the one that shows you all the comments. And um, I deleted that app from my phone, so I haven't really seen all the comments until today. I actually haven't seen any comments on YouTube until today for about the last two weeks. And today I saw them for five minutes and I was like, this is why I delete the app. <laughs> In five minutes, it was like, you're not funny, um, you're, you, you hate women, uh, you're really rude to so-and-so, you are a scum, all that thing. In the first five minutes of reading that, well, like the first 20 comments, half of them said that. And I'm like, this is why I delete the app. <laughs> this is why I delete the app for stuff like that. So uh, majority of the comments though were really nice. Thank you guys so much um, for that on that on that video. It was just late at night. I was burnt out. I decided to sit down and record and share my thoughts with the world. And I'm glad I did, you know? So it's something about just releasing stuff, putting out in the universe makes you feel really good. And I did that and I'm happy. I am happy uh, I did that. Um, a life update to the channel. The channel is not going away. I am not stopping YouTube. I'm gonna continue making YouTube. But like I kind of said in that video, YouTube is not my main source of income. Um, YouTube used to pay um, my bills, um, but it wasn't my main source. I'm making way more um, on whatnot than I am on YouTube. So, uh, I kind of started focusing more attention on where the bills are getting paid, hence the whatnot. And I try to use last week as kind of a um, test trial week to see what happens. If I put a lot more focus on whatnot, what can kind of happen to me? So uh, a, a little of um, analytics, your little numbers. So you guys see right here of the screenshot, this is kind of how much I make made on YouTube in the last month. Um, a thousand eight hundred dollars. <laughs> so that's a lot less than I used to make because again, I'm providing a little less videos now. I usually I make about three to thirty five hundred dollars on YouTube, where I was until last year, where it's dropped at about three thousand dollars, which enough, which kind of I guess pays my bills. I kept saying that because the rent for this place that I'm in is about three grand a month. <laughs> If you look up Pinellas County, if you look at Largo, the city where I live in Florida, you will see that's not too terrible to pay for rent, especially if a house is big as mine. But that's about YouTube pretty much kind of covered that until it didn't, until my videos started tanking and all that happened. So uh, that's kind of how much I make a month on YouTube, right? Last week, I was like, let me see what happens if I go heavy on whatnot. And every single day on the whatnot, I went live last week. It's the first time I have ever done that, where I went live every single day. And I did a show every single day. Did a show sometimes even twice a day. In the last week, I did nine shows. I took screenshots of them right here. You guys will be looking at um, the results of those. And some of the shows were as short as 15 minutes. Some of them were as long as three and a half hours. Um, that was the longest one. Most of them were about 30 minutes to an hour, uh, sometimes two hours. Again, some of them were 15 minutes, some of them were 20 minutes, some of them were half an hour. And I was like, let's see what happens if I go every single day, if I, if I 
dive into this head first and see what happens. And as you guys see uh, by the screenshots, in one week on whatnot, I made close to $3,500 when I took it seriously. And compared to a whole month on YouTube, when I'm taking it seriously, I made less than two grand. So that was just an eye-opening thing for me of where I should be focusing my time, my energy, and everything else into. If I can do that every single week and make about 14000 on whatnot, then compared to 2000 on YouTube, um, not to mention um, eBay still being there. I still sell about three items a day on eBay. It just makes a lot more sense financially for me to focus my time, my energy there. And plus, I'm having way, 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 way more fun. And it's so much better for my mental health to be on whatnot where people are nice to me. And they come in and they treat me with respect. And if somebody is a troll, they can get kicked out and do that. Instead of me spending my time and energy on putting videos out and then I get called a, uh, a, a womanizer, an abuser, or a scumbag, all these things. So like, what's the point? <laughs> what's the point of me doing that? So long story short, um, if you guys want to see more of me, I will be live on whatnot probably every day or at least every other day doing a show, going live for a couple of minutes, uh, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, 40 minutes. Um, I will be multi-streaming a lot of these shows. So if you guys do still want to see me and don't have whatnot, I'll be multicasting the same time on YouTube as I am on whatnot. So I won't be having time to read all the, the chats and stuff while I'm on YouTube. But if you do want to see me, I will be leaving those up so you guys can kind of watch the replays or, or whatever if you guys want to see me or if you want to see sky um that's going to happen but i am going to be decreasing the amount of videos i put out quite a bit um i will i'm going to try to say i'm going to do one video a week but i i don't know i'm going to try to commit to one video a week <laughs> but again i don't know so that's kind of what's happening here. I'm still recording. I still go to garage sale. I still put the camera on. Now, usually people, uh, when they go away from the YouTube and people have the burnout and they stop and they stop YouTube, the first thing is they leave the GoPro at home. I still bring the GoPro with me when I'm going out picking. So that's still out there. I mean, I went to Webster's for Labor Day. I didn't bring it with me there because I just don't like recording at, at, at flea markets. But when I go to garages and stuff, the, the camera is still out. I still record. I still have plenty of footage um, that, I, that I can go through and do it. Um, I just, this week, I sat down three times to edit and I sat down for five minutes and I was like, I'm not feeling it. So I would have to fully like be committed to it and maybe designate a day. And the day could be today. Today is Sunday, September 15th. Um, I'm recording this. So yeah, I should be seeing this on Monday. Sunday is kind of my free day. So um, maybe I can dedicate today to, to editing and just putting out at least one video a week. But because again, I don't want to just put some garbage out there for the people. I still care about my craft. I care about what videos I put out. And I don't want to put out something that I'm not proud of. So I could just, you know, just release some some junk out there every single day for you guys for you watch. But I don't want that. You guys don't want that. I want a video that I'm proud of to be released. And right now I just don't have the passion to do that. And if the passion is not there, it's hard for me to produce a good product. The passion right there is for me to be on one night right now and to be entertaining on there. Uh, to be with this baby right there, to, to sell things. I have so much stuff to sell. My house is just packed with stuff. So right now it's getting to the hot season here in Florida. I am finding amazing stuff for low prices. I can bring it to whatnot and sell it for a little higher than what I bought it. And as you see, I'm making pretty good money. Those of you guys are concerned about me being homeless because I sell on whatnot. Like I made almost $3,500 last week or whatnot. So I'm not going to be homeless. <laughs> uh, whatnot is, is good. And I, I figure if I can put more focus and more energy and more attention, those numbers will just go up and up and up and up. So that will, so that's kind of what is happening. Um, in, in my life, I also hired a worker. If you guys don't know, I hired Nikki. You guys see her in, in, in the videos with me, Nikki's Corner. She's on that as well. I hired her to come work for me. She helps me pack. She helps me ship. She helps me take pictures for stuff to put on whatnot. So I have an employee now that kind of helps me out a lot. The best help that it gives me is one day off. So today is Sunday. Usually my Sundays are packed shipping my mega Saturday shows because I sell a lot on Saturday. 
one of the screenshots was from Saturday. That's the one with the biggest shipments. That one was the one that for like $1,200 or something that I made. That's the Saturday show. And usually I spend all day Sunday packing that show. But because I have Nikki coming for me every single Monday now, I just take kind of Sunday off. But today I hang out with her. Me and her went to the beach this morning. Yes, we did. Did we go to the beach? Yes, we did. We hung out. We went. I, I, I cooked. I had some chicken thighs today. I had some grilled chicken thighs for lunch. We had some air fried chicken thighs for dinner. So I got to cook food all day today. That was great. Uh, watched Red Zone all day. Hung out. And I listed about 40 things to whatnot, which takes no time at all now because it's whatnot so it takes it's really easy to list and then i had a whatnot show for 20 minutes that was my day today <laughs> that that was the whole day today um and right now it's 10 p.m and i'm recording this video so um really easy day a lazy day a day of rest which sundays i guess is what's supposed to be right so that feels good and i'm not packing all day like i used to on sundays and Tomorrow, Nikki's gonna be here. Me and her are gonna be packing Saturday show and today's show, and we're gonna be preparing for the future shows for the week. But it's just good to have that day off. So one of the best things that I have with hiring Nikki is I get at least one day of rest, and then the rest of it kind of takes care of over itself. So uh, that's a really big step that I made in my business was hiring her. Uh, let's see if if my business continues to grow and I continue to have multiple shows, I might have to hire another person to keep up with the demand. But right now, um, the future is bright for me on whatnot and I wanna focus on that and take advantage of that. I still think whatnot is in the intimacy of the app that it can be. I feel like it is Amazon in the 90s. Now, do I think it's gonna be as big as Amazon? No, I'm just trying to compare it to what where it is people think oh whatnot's like at its peak i still think it's not i think it's <laughs> at its like infancy level uh i think more and more people are discovering it more and more buyers are discovering it. that's the most important thing is that they already the sellers kind of knew about it, but now more and more buyers are discovering it and i seeing from my shows that i'm getting more and more collectors buying than just resellers. Before it was just kind of resellers, kind of people that, that, that followed me. Now I see more and more people that are actually buying this stuff for themselves and they're collecting. And because of that, the price of these items goes up as well. So I'm hoping that the, there's more and more buyers discover whatnot and the, the sellers can do a good job of um, giving a good first impression of what not what not is so they can continue to come and buy and have a good pleasant experience that is more affordable to them than the Amazons or the eBay of the world and the app will continue to grow. So uh, that's kind of, so I want to be there for that growth. Like I said, on my, um, on my, um, I quit video, I wish I could go back in time and take whatnot seriously two years ago when I was one of the people that was saying whatnot sucks and all these things. If I wish I could take them seriously back then, I don't even know where I would be now on the app. But now that I'm taking it seriously now, I um, I don't know. We'll just see where the future goes. So, yeah, that's kind of the long story short of this video is that I'm doing good. Thank you guys so much for your concerns. Uh, I'm doing good. I'm doing better than I've been doing in a while. I'm very happy. I'm very happy with my life. I'm very happy with where my energy and attention is going. If I don't know if you guys don't see me replying to your comments, it's because the app is deleted. I don't see the comments anymore. I don't see how my videos are performing anymore. That stuff doesn't bother me now if the video is a 10 out of 10 it's a 10 out of 10 <laughs> if the video is a 1 out of 10 it's a 1 out of 10 i don't keep up with it i just let it go now i'm just going to release it to the world and whatever happens um whatever happens happens the milestones i was chasing so hard um if they get hit they get hit my life will not change if i don't hit fifty thousand dollars fifty thousand dollars fifty thousand subscribers before the end of the year um but because a lot of you guys know me on YouTube. I don't want to just let you guys, so I don't want to just leave you guys for whatnot and just say sayonara, bye. Uh, that wouldn't be fair to a lot of you guys that have been watching me for a while. So that's why I want to commit to at least putting out one video a week. One video of me picking a week, but it's going to be a really good video um, with the new editing that I did for the last videos, that kind of same editing style with the comps and all stuff at the end because you guys deserve it. You guys have been following me for a while and I want to lead you guys in the dark. I want to, no, I want to keep providing you guys with some, some good content. So, yep, that's going to be it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. 
Um, uh, oh yeah, Sky merch. People can be asking kind of for Sky merch. I, I, I've been had Sky stickers, just they are and whatnot. So if you guys do want to buy them, they look like this. Um, there's Sasha and Sky, Philly Flipper stickers. People have been asking for something with Sky. And that's what we have right here with Sky right here. You got these stickers. If, if you guys want them, they're on whatnot. They're $4 for two of them with um, first class envelope shipping. So it's like 70 cents to ship. So if you guys want them, they're on whatnot. And uh, if you use the link down below to sign up for whatnot, you get 15 free dollars. So that means you can get some free stickers. So if you want to check out whatnot, you want to see how it, how it looks, use the link down below, sign up for whatnot, get yourself 15 free books, and then get yourself some free stickers. So that's it. Um, that's it. That's all you're going to see from me this week. Thank you guys so much for watching. I do appreciate and love all of you guys. All of you guys have a fantastic day, a fantastic week, a fantastic month, and we will see you guys next time. Say bye, Scott.